The final irrigation protocol concludes with a final rinse of isopropyl alcohol. Due to its high evaporation rate, isopropyl alcohol decreases the number of paper points required to dry the canal. Bulk fluid can be removed from the canal by placing back pressure on the plunger of the irrigation syringe. This also decreases the number of paper points needed to dry the canal. 0.04 tapered paper points are then used in order to wick up any fluid that remains in the canal. 0.04 tapered paper points should be used in preparations of 0.06 taper or greater in order to ensure that the paper point will reach the apical extent of the canal without binding coronally. The paper point is removed from the canal and lightly tapped against the mirror. If the paper point bends when tapped against the mirror, the canal is not dry. A dry canal is indicated only when the paper point is removed from the canal and remains stiff after tapping against the mirror. The mirror test is a predictable way to determine that the canal is free of fluid and ready to obturate. Prior to the application of the obturation material, the electronic apex locator is used to reconfirm the working length as well as apical patency. Once an accurate confirmation is obtained, the clinician can now move on to obturation.